Hey guys, welcome back again to another Technology Guru video. Today we are back in Adobe InDesign and I will be showing you how to understand and use the alignment grid or the alignment tools within Adobe InDesign. One of the key and most amazing features within InDesign, in my opinion, is the way they use the alignment grid. Now you may be asking yourself and me, what is the alignment grid? What is these alignment lines that you're referring to? Well, what I'm talking about is if I grab this yellow square or rectangle here, you will notice a few things happen. There are some lines that pop up. If you see here, there's two little green lines there. And then if I bring it over to the right a little more, it'll show me a pink line, which means I am horizontally, I mean, excuse me, I am vertically centered. And then if I go up, there'll be a, another pink line right here. So if you see two pink lines, one going up and down, the other going from the left to the right, you know your object is in the exact center of the artboard or page that you are working on. Now, something that is even cooler than that. Now, if I want this square to be exactly in between this blue polygon and this green circle, I just click on it and hold it and I drag it down until I see exactly what I've seen there. Now I have those two green arrows going up and down on each side, the top and the bottom of my yellow square, and I know now that my yellow square is exactly in between these two objects. Now this is wonderful when trying to center pictures, when you're working with different kind of programs, and you're trying to lay out a lot of pictures, and you want them to be diagonally centered, you want them to be in between, you want the same distance in between, you can really go up through here, and you can drag the square around and see, okay, now, if I drag this uh, square down here, you see now there's two other green arrows that come up. This is telling me that this yellow square has the exact same amount between the blue polygon and the title text, which is how to use InDesign alignment tools. Now, if you go up here and go to window, okay, you're not going to be able to see anything up here that you want to see as far as the alignment grids go. But if you go to InDesign and then go to Preferences, okay, you can go up here and go to Grids. Now, once you're in Grids here, you can see that you have your baseline grid, what color it is, where you want it to start, and kind of where it's going. Now, if you go down to Guides and Pasteboard, it'll show you all the margins and the bleeds and all that stuff. You can actually go in here and adjust that. But if you're just a beginner, or just now starting with Adobe InDesign, the main things you need to focus on is really paying attention to those lines and getting used to know exactly what those lines mean. So hopefully this has helped you out. Hopefully you understand the alignment grid a little better. I'll do a more in-depth video on this at a later date, but right now go play around with that within InDesign. If you have any questions regarding this tool, go ahead and put them in the comment box below. Don't forget to hit the thumbs up button on this video. It really helps me out. Share it with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe for more great content, and I will see you guys next time.